This has to be like, this has to be interesting. This is like North Soul Wall. This is yeah. so, so, so Wall. Yeah, so it's, for those unfamiliar in the chat, Soa is sort of divided into subregions, and those of those subregions, Infest comes from sort of the lower part of Soa, like more of the Olympia area. Uh, he's a decent Ice Climbers player. <laughs> Look at this play that's starting out here. Hello. Um, he works really well with like single things, but if you separate, uh, his Sopo's a little easier to handle. Yeah, that's like that's Ice Climbers since character. Yeah. You can really tell that Infest is like going for like all the icy stuff. So like yep. he's going for these things, everything. Yep. I don't know if Oso fan is like really know this matchup. A lot of people just don't know this matchup. Yeah, that's it's really interesting. Yeah. Los uh Infest oh, can get a man. lot off of matchup on familiarity, but also Villager has some really yeah. solid edge guarding tools here. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, no, he, he he's not familiar with this. Yeah, so he's totally one of the things that ice climbers will do is they'll do falling bear and just cover a large amount of area when they're uh, ledge trapping you. Uh, and it's especially for villager and Isabel players who like do like drop down fair a lot. That's really easy uh, for ice climbers to cover. You can see it like forces out a roll basically. Oh yeah. Uh, or like a jump air dodge. Uh, Lozofan is doing a respectable job. Yeah, he so, is. A little information on Lozofan. So Lozofan, you know this already. He's from the UW yeah, Tacoma yeah. area. Yeah, he's PR there. Yeah, he's, he's, he's one of the best players. Ooh, yeah, down yeah, smash! Yeah. Your berries are so good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's Ooh. a lot, actually. <laughs> Tree, one of uh, Villager's best comeback tools in the it's, right situation. Dude, that was even now. <laughs> it's even? Yeah. Look at the. Okay, so look at the way that Lozofan is mixing up his move speeds. So he's doing a little bit of running, a little bit of moving. Very cautious Villager player. Yeah. Um, and as he's starting to learn, the, he's learning the matchup in real time yeah. right now. Yeah. And you can see that he's starting to pick things up. He's looking for different ways to separate Nana and Popo. See little jabs in close yeah. quarters, just small boxing oh, that's things. Nice. That's, ooh, ooh, he's that dead. Was, uh, interesting match, actually. I feel like he could get all that. I know. I know. It's deceptive. Yeah, it's really. There was those down smash. It's not one of those berries where you. It's like you're stuck in it forever. It's not like. It's not like Roller. You could no. get out of it, like, clearly. But um, it's, it's definitely it's, a surprise Yeah, it's a, really, it's, it's a really good first option. If honestly. you get hit with the first hit, it's a lot harder to react to than if you get hit with the second hit. Oh, yeah, yeah he's oh, keeping them separate. Yeah. Definitely. This is exactly how you should be playing this. Oh, wait, question. But also, Infest has really good options here in this event. Oh! Okay. Actually, wait, no, he's not there. Okay, that was... That, that was super cool, though. Yeah. That could have been really big for a Lozo fan if, if Nana died from that F-Smash. Wow, do you see he caught the jump side B there with uh, fireworks, up smash. Wow. I, know what, I really wish they gave Nana a percentage. Because, like, I really wonder how much what Nana's at right now. Because, like, yeah. I don't know. What, I feel like anything would go down right now. Look at the struggle situation. Oh, so much damage. Oh, oh, oh that's oh, nice. Oh, he's not dead. He's not dead. That's huge, though. Oh, wait. Oh. oh no, Nana's back on stage! Oh, Lozo? Okay. Oh. I, I suspect he's... a back air is going to take it, if nothing else. Here's oh, a, but there's another... Nana's off stage! Okay, here's another problem with. Ooh. This is what I notice with a lot of people. In every game I see it in. Ooh. Yeah, see? Yeah, this, one, this, is, this, is, this is what I'm talking about. Okay, so pretty much. A lot of players just tunnel vision on Nana. They, oh, know, yeah. they do not realize that Popo is a thing. <laughs> yeah. Popo is the one that the player is acting with and has so full like, control over. So like Lozo back throw him, then you got S match right away. Oh but absolutely. Yeah. Then yeah, like yeah, yeah. then like then like two seconds later, after you get out back on stage, you it's try to she try to chase down Nana instead of this wall. And with Popo. villagers net, it's a gamble which one yeah, you're gonna yeah, get. Yeah. So you have to you have to do the safest possible throw, yeah. and that's gonna be different depending on who. Infest was doing really good there because he was cognizant mm, yeah. uh, of whether he was the one being grabbed or not. I was able to act immediately in that situation. That yeah. turned the game around for yeah. him so uh, well. If Lozo just focused on Popo more, he could have got it. It's, oh, like, yeah. it's kind of like ironic information to tell you because you, you want to get rid of no Nana, but if you yeah. just get rid of Popo, then that's a stock pretty much. And you you want to separate them without sacrificing like you just want to wall out both of them at the same yeah. time it's really interesting you you have to switch between who you're focusing yeah. on pretty much at all times because yeah so now he needs to switch priority 
uh, after he separates them. And basically, constantly focus on shifting where he wants to move his popo to. Well, I see he's do so much. <laughs> you see yeah. the, the, the opposite directions with the oh. little freezy wind. God. Okay, that's yep. good. That's decent. Yep. Now you wall. Okay, right, yeah. Yep. Oh, that's and now, that's, yeah. that's huge. Okay, that's perfect. Dead. And so, uh, Sopo versus Villager is one of the toughest Sopos to yeah. fight against. Uh, because, yeah, you have narrowed a shield against any of uh, Popo's, like, aerials on shield. Ooh. Yeah, look. Well, this game oh, is Lozo's fans. That stock in particular is Lozo's fans to yeah. lose. I know. We'll see. Lozo can do more of that. Really. Mm. This entire, like, set is going to hinge on... Lozo fan's ability to separate infests Nana and Popo. Yeah. How safe are their aerials? I really want to know. Uh, it depends on which tilt you follow up with, or... No, like, Icy's aerials. Like, yeah. It's like, I don't know if you can punish these, like, these back airs or anything. It seems really interesting. I generally avoid it. Ooh. Like, Grab's he's not like, gonna net anything. Because, like, infest is getting away with a lot of, like, aerials on the shield. And I feel like you can get away... I feel like... You, you're, he can, Lozo can punish it. I don't know really how. So, the, the interesting thing that makes this matchup very tricky, notice how, okay, so there are two approach options on Lozo Fan's shield. There's landing Nair, and then there's landing back air, right? And in each of those, it, it depends if you grab. Uh, oh, that's huge, actually. Oh, God, oh, I yeah. Dude, I that's see. it. <laughs> Ices. I swear, Ices is like the best character of the game and the worst at the same time. It's yeah. really interesting. Like that up air is just gonna yeah. take it right there. But like, okay, so he lands with Nair on shield and Popo's facing the front. Uh, he lands uh, with Bear on shield and Nana's facing uh, the front. So if he grabs Nana off of a Bear out of shield, uh, Bear on his shield, then Infest is gonna be in a position to punish. Oh, God. Lozofan is in such an advantageous position right now. Ooh, yes. shield pressure. Do I see struggle in approaching? I feel like... Uh, when they have... <laughs> when they don't have the lead? Absolutely. Look oh, at that! that that's not soft. Okay. Yep. Oh, that was nice. This might be death. I hope. Yep. Oh, 100%. Because Icy's like to drop down and then do some kind of aerial. Mm. It's, it's very similar to Villager. Uh, in the Villager Dato, you often catch people doing that. Yeah. It's called the aerials out of, like, that situation are really good. Yep. It's like all... Because you can do, like, that up air, and it's just, like, it's so much damage, yeah. you can follow up with it. It's really nice. What's it called? I'm surprised Lozo followed. What's it called? I'm... I'm really happy... Let's see. I'm surprised that Lozo, like, like, read the option, really. Like... Yeah. Good. Well, in fast goes just, like, dash to it. It's game attack and, like, anything. Yeah. They could have way more position. It's really... Oh, it's really but, interesting. But like Infest needed to get yeah, back, yeah, yeah, so yeah. the conditioning from Lozofan there was really well done. Yeah. I feel like Lozofan's really good at like reading your options, really. <laughs> he, like, he like limits it, but then reads the ones you have left, it's like really... Yeah, he, he's a very fun villager to play yeah, against yeah. too, I will tell you that. Yeah. Um, yep. Oh, you, oh this is huge. Yeah. Oh, 40? <laughs> 58? <laughs> 20 damage off of a single side B. Oh my god, that's so much damage. Do you, see the, do you see how he got Nana to cover the ledge trump option there and then oh, F smash? Yeah. So that covers so many, like, it covers a really unorthodox spread of get up options. Yeah. And so the result is, oh, yeah. Yeah. He okay. had to roll out of that. Okay, so what I've been noticing is that, like, I feel like, I think almost every aerial that Net Let's Ices have are safe. It's like, because, like, yeah, for you the get, most part it is. Because if you get back air, there's, there's not always a second back air, so you have like double the hit stun. It's really. You see both of those up smash? You see the area coverage there? Oh, oh, oh this is huge. Oh, do you see? Oh, what's happening? Oh. Yep. <laughs> yep. These are, yeah, these are yeah. the. <laughs> these are the infest desync combos. Dude, I don't. Finding a good ice is super scary. It's terrifying. Like, especially on FD. Yeah. I'm actually surprised to go here. This is like where these lab. <laughs> Yeah, you do not. Oh, well. Oh! <laughs> In fact, Nana almost got him with that. Nana was way off. He was like, you killed it? Whack. At low percent, really, the only thing you can get off of landing there is jab. I don't know if he didn't know that or he went for it and it still wasn't safe against ice climbers. Yeah. 
Uh, but that's the usual. Oh, okay, Nana's huge. separated. Oh, oh, that could be huge. So one of the toughest. Oh, that's a really interesting. I'm surprised that Gab, that Gab had invincibility still. Yeah. So the toughest transition that a lot of villager players had, uh, transitioning ooh, ooh, okay. into ultimate was the down air. Yeah, the down air has a slower startup, and so it doesn't oh, edge guard in the same way. Oh. Yep. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's dead. There, he's, he's, he's dead because you can do that. Yeah. And oh, oh okay. Now he's in the lead, dude. Like ten seconds ago. But it takes. Lozo was so behind. And now it's just. Yeah, it's even. It's really. God, it's really this set is so intense. Oh. Oh. Decides oh. Not, not to opt for a narrow to shield there. Dude, the so clash even. with the Lloyd is gonna get him some good stuff. Oh, oh axe now the axe is out. Yeah. So far, oh, out of they're, all the villagers, long, I would long. say it's a tie between him and Scalchop for the most proficient with... Oh, uh, this is huge. Don't... Oh, yeah. Oh, they're back together. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, he didn't get the decent. Oh, but look. Infest is cornering him. Yeah. Oh, that's huge. Wow. Oh, he, he needs, at like 130 right now. He needs to separate and not commit with the down smash. Dude. He That's... tried to kill Nana so badly, even though. Oh, Trump, this is huge. Oh, okay, that's a really nice wall. Oh, oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. That was enough damage. Oh, oh my god! Okay. Oh my god. Lozo fan with Dude. the bowling ball secures the win. Dude, Lozo was so behind. <laughs> What an incredible was, comeback from Lozo fans. He was two socks behind. <laughs> what an awesome set to yeah. start out the day. <laughs>